Do you talk to your dog and wonder if they're actually listening? Well, science is finally giving us an answer that will blow your mind. Researchers put dogs into MRI machines and what they discovered changes everything we thought we knew about our furry friends. Here's what will shock you. Your dog's brain has special voice areas that light up only for human voices. Not barking, not traffic noise, just your voice. But it gets even crazier. Their brain splits the job like a supercomputer. The left side processes what you say, like the word walk, while the right side processes how you say it. And here's the mind-blowing part. Their brain's reward center only fires when your words and tone match perfectly. Say good boy in a happy voice, brain fireworks. Say it flat and boring, nothing. Your dog literally needs your sincerity to feel rewarded. Now, you're probably thinking, how did they even get dogs to sit still in those loud, scary MRI machines? The Hungarian research team at Edvosh Larand University pulled off something incredible. They trained 13 family dogs to lie perfectly still for up to 8 minutes without any sedation. Just months of patient training using praise and play, these dogs voluntarily became the first canines to have their minds read by science. But wait, it gets even weirder. Your dog processes your voice faster than you can blink, literally. EEG data shows that they can tell the difference between your voice and a stranger's in just 250 to 650 milliseconds. That's faster than most humans answer a text message. This lightning fast voice recognition likely helped their wolf ancestors survive by instantly identifying friend from foe. And here's something that'll give you the chills. When dogs hear happy human sounds, the exact same brain regions that make us feel joy become active in their heads. The same goes for sadness and anger. Your emotions aren't just visible to your dog, they're literally contagious on a brain level. They don't just see that you're upset, they can actually feel it with you. It's like having an emotional mind reader living in your house. Think your dog only knows sit and stay? Think again. A border collie named Chaser learned over a thousand words. That's more vocabulary than some toddlers have. But here's the really wild part. She could figure out new toy names by process of elimination, just like a human child. Show her three toys she knows and one she doesn't, say, get the frisbee, and she'll grab the unknown toy because she knows it must be the frisbee. That's not just memory, that's reasoning. If your mind is officially blown right now, smash that like button and drop a comment. What's the weirdest thing you have ever said to your dog? I bet they understood more than you think. Here's a myth that needs to die. The idea that you should only use commands and avoid chatting with your dog. Dog trainers have been saying this for decades, but the science proves the opposite. Casual, affectionate conversation actually keeps your dog's brain tuned to your voice frequency. This makes them more likely to listen when you do give a command, not less. So go ahead, narrate your day to your dog. Their brain loves it. So how can you use this brain science in real life? First rule, make your tone match your words. If you're correcting bad behavior, don't use a sweet voice. This creates confusion in their neural pathways. Second, be consistent with commands. Use come every time and not get over here sometimes and come here other times. Their brain maps specific sounds to specific actions. Third, talk to your dog throughout the day. Narrating what you're doing, I'm making a coffee now, or time to check the mail, strengthens your vocal bond and keeps their brain engaged. But let's be realistic here. Your dog isn't about to understand Shakespeare or help you with your taxes. They excel at linking single words to objects and actions, but they don't understand grammar or complex sentences. 
A phrase like, get the red ball from under the couch, becomes one giant sound cue to them over time. So keep commands short and punchy. Save the longer conversations for emotional bonding, not complex instructions. Ready for the most mind-bending discovery yet? Researchers are now studying whether dogs replay their owners' voices in their heads when they're alone. Basically, whether dogs daydream about you, and the early results are incredible. Brain scans show their voice processing areas lighting up even after their owner has left the room. Your dog might literally be remembering the sound of your voice while you're out buying groceries. They could be having mental conversations with you right now. This research reveals something profound about the 15,000 year relationship between humans and dogs. We didn't just domesticate their bodies, we rewired their brains to be obsessed with our voices. No other animal on Earth has evolved specialised brain regions just for processing human speech. Wolves don't have this. Wild dogs don't have this. Only our dogs developed this superpower. So, the next time you talk to your dog, remember, this isn't a one-way conversation. Their brain is working overtime to decode not just your words, but your emotions, your intentions, and your relationship with them. You're participating in an ancient neural network that connects two different species through the power of voice. Your words are literally one of the most important things in their world. Share this video with every dog person in your life and hit subscribe for mind... for more mind? More mind-blowing animal science that'll change how you see the world. And remember, go talk to your dog right now. Science says they're hanging on to every word.